farming in Titan with my dragons, including a huge fail. Let's try to get back above 4400 trophies, because that's really where I want to be. And I did a stupid attack just yesterday where I lost 25 trophies, that mainly because I attacked without having my clan castle with me. Those of you who joined me in my livestream have seen it happen live. A huge fail there, uh, basically I attacked this guy. And yeah, at this moment where I already uh, dropped the lightning spell, I reckon <laughs> I, I found out, at this moment I found out uh, that I'm not having the clan castle with me because I was missing the earthquake spell. But it was too late, I had to attack and I thought this is gonna be a huge fail, there was actually no way. Uh, this could not be a fail because those air defenses are up and they're targeting my dragons and it's never a good idea to attack with dragons when the air defenses are all up. So basically you see what happened here, a lot of the dragons already taken out by the first air defense they encountered. Now on the left side, dragons taken out by the air defense and also on the right side, those dragons already very weak. And yeah, attacked by the air defense there and there is a single target inferno on this map as well. And that doesn't really make it easier for those dragons, uh, quite the opposite. It's gonna take them down easily and I'm only at 36% right now. So yeah, you can see it there. It's gonna be a huge fail. Uh, I, I I don't really I don't really mind that much because I'm not looking for trophies. I just want to stay above 4,400. That's what I'm trying. I want to remain in Titans 2 because the bonus is so great in Titan 2. That's why I'm trying to stay there. There you see. Also, the queen couldn't help, and it's a loss of 25 trophies. And what hurts even more is no bonus. Now let's find a base to attack and at least get back above 4400. Okay, I'm gonna attack this guy here basically because the queen is sleeping, the king is sleeping, so that's a good choice there. Uh, he has two multi target, which is also nice for attacks with dragons. And I think best is I'm gonna attack here from where the eagle defense is, so that means I'm gonna take care of that air defense over here first. So let's drop those lightning spells on that air defense, close enough to take out the wizard tower as well. And the earthquake spell, this time I have the earthquake spell with me. And now I'm gonna drop those dragons and the clan castle with the lava hound, that's gonna be next. I wanna take care of that air defense there. Uh, on the sides of this attack and let's see how that this works So the first Inferno Tower is already taken out, the second one will probably survive, he's going for those dragons. I froze him for a little bit there, but it's probably not enough for those dragons to go for the Town Hall. Now the dragon's working on that Town Hall, go for it, go for it, I'm at 58%, will they make it with that Town Hall? We don't know. It's pretty close actually, two dragons working, yes, yes, there goes the Town Hall. And it's a two star win, that at least will give me back some trophies here. Um, I basically care about the loot more, but yeah, it's always nice to have a two trophy win. And now the last dragon is down. Uh, yeah, let's try to get more gold here. What I'm gonna do is drop the king and the queen up here. And take, try to take uh, that gold storage up there. So the queen already going for that gold storage, adding more gold to my loot. And yes, there it goes. It is down. Uh, also get me to 70%, yes. And that gives me basically the full bonus. 
uh, and let the queen just finish her job. Uh, there she's gone, and look at that la nice loot, really beautiful loot there. 426k gold, 280k elixir, and on top of this, 300k bonus. And that's really the reason why I want to stay in Titan 2. Farming in Titan 2 is awesome. It's one attack, 700k gold, that's really awesome. Okay guys, and here I'm back with my troops ready for my next attack. And let's see whether we find somebody to attack. Hopefully we're gonna find some really big loot like in the attack we did before. So I'm gonna go against this base here. It's pretty similar to the base before and it has a main mistake here um, when the wizard tower is really close to the air defense. So I think that's a good one to attack. Also the heroes are asleep. Uh, that's what I like and the loot here is not bad on this base. So first I'm gonna lightning on that air defense. Yeah, not enough to destroy the wizard tower, but that's okay. And yeah, now let's drop those dragons. And the warden right behind. And let's speed up those dragons a little bit. Uh, I prefer to speed up the dragons on the, the outside. To make sure they funnel as they should. So now those dragons go for the for the chicken, <laughs> for the eagle defense already, which is nice. Take it down, please. And uh, now probably I should get rid of that inferno tower and the expo. And hopefully, hopefully I can also get that town hall. Uh, the first star already there with 51%. Uh, going for the town hall. It's gonna be a close call there. I think this time it may not be sufficient. Dragon fighting the warden. Oh no, that was close. So the town hall is still up. Um, yeah, let's put, push the percentages a bit more here. Um, maybe, maybe I'm gonna try to enter the base here with the king. No, he's going there. <laughs> now the king takes a long walk instead of just going uh, through the wall where he should. So let's put the queen there for assistance. Yeah, I wanted to go in there um, for the, the dark elixir. That didn't really work out. And now the king is working on the wall. The queen uh, probably will take a walk. <laughs> Yeah, she goes for the expo area uh, where she will be killed immediately by that expo. How stupid is that? No, queen! You shouldn't go there. Yeah, look at that stupid king there. He likes the walls and the queen basically got killed for nothing there. Yeah, and the king dying here at the wall. So no way to get inside that inner area there. Uh, because of those heroes, because the way they act. But still, the loot is okay. Uh, it's 500k gold, about 300k, a bit more than 300k elixir. And yeah, the trophies, I don't really care, but it's 2k dark elixir as well. So, I hope you enjoyed this episode. Thanks for watching the full length of the video. And please check out my other videos. And don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel to get future episodes. Thanks, and meet you again soon.